Hello and welcome back to Fallout 3 with yours truly Lord of the Mad. Hi Lord of Flusses, how are we just spiffing? Level 22, Boxer Smell Man, good as fuck in 2013 and all around neutral guy. I did check the map while I was on the interwebs, the wiki, to see where exactly this host box is meant to be. And to be fair, if I had been patient enough to wait for while I actually got around to editing the episode then I would have noticed this door then and here's the host box with the safe key you're not cherry bombs hmm the niches maybe uh, let's take some money and some ammunition it's a good place to be I feel Lots of pre-war money I can sell. And the locked box there. Some health. Hmm. I also need to look into what those skills do that I have. All of the skills. Ah, more ammo there. Good, good. Because I suspect that the actually utilizing the what you call it medicine skill might help me with my ability to use steam packs is that correct yeah yeah it is okay i should probably put some points into that then somewhere ah right i'm not sure if this was the right route to take for the following adventure. It's what I'm taking. Also, while editing, I kind of noticed that I probably can actually be just as effective against these bastards with a sword as I can with a gun. Which is always a pleasing thing to know. Yeah, it's just a small hole. Nothing of note inside there. I, yeah, I did some proper loading here. Nothing to worry about. Now, here's the flashing light. The rotating light, even. Hello. Alright, um. Let's start off with contact. And then I will look through the rest of them. Oh, never mind. <laughs> that was actually the second one I tried. Does this mean that the key was actually unnecessary? Well, I won't disengage the lock like this. I will use my... Wait. But I have a key as well. Oh, I accidentally broke the lockpick now. Come on. Maximize XP cane. Because that's the way to do it. I test the safe. That's what I got this key for. That is a naughty night van. Is that really what I came here to get? And they got a ripper. That sounds interesting. Um, also, do I actually want to carry this many... Oh, hello. This many lead pipes, because... I don't think I do. <laughs> it's going to do a no lot of noise though. Um, sheet the blade when it's not in use. But don't sheet it. Oh, I cannot actually live by that code anymore. There's nothing to have been drawn blood from. And, blah, 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 blah. and they didn't do it anyway because I. Put away the plate. Oh, hello. Who are you? I'm only going to ask you this one time. 
Give me the naughty nightwear. Uh. What? <laughs> How about you pay me for it? I warned you I was only going to ask once. Now I'm going to take it from you. Are you really? Because I have a blade. Opening fire. Where? You like that? You like that? Oh. Ah! Because it's awesome. <laughs> well done, well done. Put away the blade. Alright, so who was I, was I supposed to take the naughty knight for... Uh, naughty... Why do I have naughty knight for? Also, I did discover that this is more beautiful. Um, What is the damage... I mean... Oh! So, if I do repair this one instead, it will still be more effective, but it will also be prettier, because it's a different color. And it's a prettier color, as far as I know. As far as I'm concerned, anyway. Alright. Uh, <laughs> I like having this plate. Okie dokie, so what sh I should do now is return to Greyditch, tell Wilix to go to Megaton. At least I think that's a safe place for him to be. He can stay in my house if he wants to. Or, well, maybe Billy could be persuaded to adopt another. Or Nathan and uh, the lady, whose name I can't remember. What is this red item? It's a traffic cone. Exactly what I wanted. It's a shame I cannot pick it up and wear it as a hat. Because I kinda want to. Because I'm a wizard. And wizards wear wizard hats. Traffic cones are wizard hats. Right. Um, let's just hope that... Ants will not spawn every five seconds. That would be nice. Well, I suppose the surface area is now safe then. And that's what the psychic link helped resolve the pulse even. The destruction of the psychic link. Um, I'm just gonna go in here for a nap. Because this is a safe place and... Come on, it's a nice bed. Look at it. It's a good bed. Good bed. Oh. Oh. I... Yes. Yes. Ah, all of my yes. I don't know what I need it for, but all of my yes. It will... It will... It will be put to use. It will... It will bring forth happy times. And even more explosions. And at least one of those explosions will be dedicated to Eniko because she apparently likes when I explode things. Um, anyone out there? Hello? Hello. It was so weird. All of a sudden, the ants went nuts and started fighting each other. It was like they were totally crazy. It was really scary, but kind of cool at the same time. You know what I mean? Explosions. Yep, it was all me. I wish I had something to give you for all the work you did. But I never really had much to start with. I guess now you'll be on your way, and I'll have to try living here by myself. I hope you'll come back and visit someday. Um, I can't leave you here alone. Let me find you a place to live. Really? You mean it? Oh boy, thank you so much. I'll wait in my old house for you to come back. I need to bury my papa anyway. Just don't forget about me. Any idea where I can look for someone to take care of you? Well, papa always told me about my cousin Vera. She lives in some big giant ship somewhere or something. Papa called the place Rivet City, but I don't know where it is. 
then I probably have business there anyway. I wish you could stay here with me in Greyditch. No, I have to find my father. I'm sorry you lost yours, but I, mine is still alive, I think. Otherwise, the plot would be kinda quickly ended in that regard. There's another door here, which I noticed while editing. I hope there's no one home. So I can just loot it calmly. Well, it's an abandoned home. There really shouldn't be anyone home. Electronic charge pack. What is that? No idea, but I'm taking it. Full cues. Guns and bullets. It's such a heavy book that I can no longer run. I suppose I could repair my pistol. Oh, not anymore. Anything else I could repair? Or probably not. Anything in apparel? No, not really. We can read the big book of science and guns and bullets there. Which is all good. Ah, what's that? Buff out. Sure. So basically we found the drug paradise and the milk bottle. Don't do milk, kids. It actually... Milk is good for you, probably. Do milk, kids. Ooh, more money. I hope no one will assault me here because of, you know, looting all their... stuff. Uh, alcohol is also nice. Moving on downstairs. Ah, I thought that there was something different, but it's just a generator. Did I want that? No idea. I'm listening to Galaxy News Radio, and I'm your host, ah, this is good. Lord and Master of All. Okay, moving on. I think I saw another door on a different street. So I'm going to go check that out as well. There's probably this very street here. Yeah, there it is. We've gone in. Lots of abandoned homes around here. Not surprising, really. Could have been a nice neighborhood before all this began. It's only been 200 years. Oh well. Seems I can't. Uh, yes, time. Oh, that works. It's time for an update on the Vault 101, Peacekeeper. A man who proves that not everyone out there is a complete asshole. Got some great news out of the town of Megaton. Turns out the live atomic bomb in the town center has finally been deep sixed for good. The town sheriff, one Lucas Sims, commissioned the one, the only lone wanderer from Vault 101 to disarm the nasty nuke, and the kid delivered. Hey, nice work, 101. Next time you're in the neighborhood, pop into the studio. Old three dogs, toaster's been on the fritz. Until next time, this is Three Dog, Ow! and you're listening to Galaxy News Radio, bringing you the truth, no matter how bad it hurts. Now, some music. Oh, that's cool. So I have an official invitation to go to the Galaxy News radio station. That's good. Means it won't be just barging in. And that's another milk bottle. The pilot night. Did I already loot this one? Can't even tell. Carton of cigarettes. Oh yeah. Such cigarettes. What else do I need to drop? So I kinda don't want to drop anything. <laughs> Mm. Oh well, um, anything in aid I can do without, like the blood. Let's just drop, drop the blood and the meat on the ground and keep moving. That's the way to handle things, right? Then just keep looting new things. 
out of which mo most are probably more valuable. Uh, how heavy is a 10mm pistol then anyway? Oh, free. Alright, um, repair this one then. That means as soon as the other one can be repaired, I can probably give it a stronger boost than I could have otherwise. Alright, so I kind of want to return to Megaton, don't I? I think that was the plan. And then I wanted to move on to Minefield. Uh, let's look at the map then. That's Greyditch, that's Marigos. Okay, let's jump by Megaton. Ah, it takes me right inside the city. That was not part of the plan. Hello. Please, please help me. I need water. I'm dying. Here, have this purified water. Are you serious? I, I can't offer anything in exchange, you know. I, I can just have I can just have it. For free? Yeah. Really? Seriously? Oh my god. Thank you. Thank you so much. I'll never forget this. Yay, Karma! Try Bari Artis. Coldest drinks in the capital wasteland. Alright, um, thank you for watching, and I'll see you next time. Between the episodes, I will go and sell some of my... Wait, I'll talk to this guy first. Hello. Ah, welcome, weary traveler. You look like a traveler in need of relaxation and the finest of chemical assistance. Well, wander no more, my good friend, for I am Doc Hoff, procurer of the finest of medical goods and chemical assistance. Now, how may I help you? Tell me about your trade, Carmen. I provide food, drinks, and discreet chemicals to discerning customers around the wasteland. I help ease the suffering of my fellow man. For a price. I don't have a home office exactly, but I organize much of my trade with Ernest Rowe in Canterbury Commons. All right. Thank you. See you next time you need that special little something. Try the brass All right. Thank you for watching, I'll see you next time.